Welcome to uh, Brockville Braves number 55, and uh, we see an A in a sweater, uh, Ryan Walter. Uh, Ryan, I just want to say congratulations on the season so far. Uh, I think it's uh, been a good season. How have you felt about uh, up things up to this point? I think we've been doing good as of late. We had a lot of ups and downs, but uh seem to be hitting a good point right going into playoffs, peaking when we should, so I'm happy with it. Uh, and uh, I think the fans are too. Uh, maybe we just have an opportunity here to refresh our, our fans' uh, minds about you. Where's uh, home for you, Ryan? Uh, Richmond, Michigan, uh, right over the border in about 10 minutes. It's a nice, not, not bad, six-hour drive. Come right up. Well, that's good to hear. Now, what about, did you play minor hockey in Richmond, or where did you play minor hockey? Uh, I played most of my hockey growing up in Port Huron, and then I moved to uh, Oakland, Junior Grizzlies, for uh, the end of my career before I came up. Okay, so uh, Michigan through and through. Um, one thing that I, I think I want to ask you, and I think a lot of fans are interested in, uh, what do you see as your role with the Braves this year? Um, I take, I like to, I pride myself on my defensive play. I just like getting the puck out, being kind of a shutdown defender. Um, I like to jump up in the play when I feel like I can have a guy back for me, and I like to kind of just play shutdown defense. That's what I like to pride myself on. Okay, now um, uh, most of the fans who are at the games regularly know this, but those folks at home and uh, in the viewing audience might not know. Uh, who regularly is your uh, partner on defense? Uh, Matt Lorenzo. Okay, Matt Lorenzo. Uh, he's out of West Island in uh, Montreal. Uh, one observation that I've had, and I'm sure all the fans agree, that uh, you like to play a very physical game, and uh, that's what the team needs. But, you know, uh, for a very physical guy, Pretty soft hands in the, the last month or so. We've been seeing you carrying that puck in there. Uh, do you like that role as well? Oh, uh, yeah, I like doing that a little bit. I try to focus on defense, but when I get a chance, I'll hop up in there and just see what happens. Well, there, there's an old coaching philosophy, you know, and that is uh, defense is work, offense is fun. Uh, but, and there's another little rule as well, though, that I thought I would take this opportunity to mention because you, you've proved to be the exception to this rule, and that is uh, there's an old saying in hockey that uh, – once a crusher becomes a rusher, he's soon to be an usher. But uh, I think you've proved uh, the, the, uh, that that rule doesn't hold to everybody. Um, how have you adjusted to the coaching change? Have there been any issues there? Um, no, not really. I know uh, Matt pretty, Coach Ward pretty well from last year. He uh, did well, and I enjoy him as a coach now, too. Oh, that's great to hear, because uh, coaches, I think, need the support of their players. Uh, Team's now heading into the last 10 games of the season. Uh, how do you see that going? Uh, it seems like we're peaking right when we should, so hopefully we keep that up. We just kind of keep playing like we've been, kind of forget about Sunday and then move forward. Uh, speaking of moving forward, what about the focus for tonight? Any uh, hints? Has anything been said about the focus for tonight? Um, we're really just trying to focus, getting the puck out, play good D zone, and then offense should come. Well, I hope all of that happens, and uh, thank you very much, uh, Ryan, for being with us, and uh, good luck tonight and the rest of the season. Thank you.